Hey guys, OzGrillis here and today we're going to show you how to stream your iPhone to Streamlabs OBS and OBS. Let's do it. Alright guys, well first things first about this channel is we do Streamlabs OBS tutorials, OBS tutorials, Twitch tutorials and design tutorials like how to design your own sub badges and emotes for free. We also have a podcast called Talking Corner. It goes over different techniques of how to grow your channel as well as the growth of each individual owner in that podcast. So if any of this interests you, please subscribe to this channel. Check out all the videos. We've got plenty of videos here that can help you with your stream. Um, so check it out. Anyway, let's get into this video. All right, guys, so what you want to do is go to 5kplayer.com. So go to 5kplayer.com, even type it into Google, hit the link, bring it up to this screen here. What we do is go to the free download here for Windows. I do not have a Mac, so I cannot do that one, sorry. Um, but I'd say it would run very similar to how we're doing this one. So then what we want to do, install 5k player. So once it's finished installing, open it up and it'll bring it up to this screen. So then just go to the DLNA and AirPlay, hit that. And then on the left here from the settings, go down to AirPlay, make sure it's on, obviously. Um, make sure your phone and your PC are on the same network. And then what you do is you get your phone, your iPhone, scroll from the top right, bring it down to so your menus there. And then go to screen mirroring. And then it'll give you the computer name with 5K player in front of it. So just hit that. And there's your screen connected. So we'll do it here. I'll show you now we've connected. So I've got my finger up on the top right, bringing it down. Got our menu. Screen mirroring is the probably rectangle there that has 5k player desktop on it hit that select which one you've got the screen that I've got now so so now what we do <clears throat> bring that into a full screen probably turn your notifications off on your phone when you're going to be streaming a game uh, so you've got it here so we're going to go back to the live scene all right so we're back to the live scene here so as you can see this is just my normal twitch twitch screen um, so it's going to work exactly the same as doing a normal stream. It's going to take like zero processing power, uh, which is awesome as well if you're running a lower end PC. Uh, so what you got to do now, so you bring up a game. If it is a horizontal game, you know, such as you know, PUBG, your Fortnite stuff, we're going to do Fallout Vault right now. So we'll bring you back to this, just put it back to full screen. You know, it looks like you're playing a game when you're just playing on your phone. So quite simple there and then everything else is set up. So what you want to do to get this screen, you got to go into your sources and add a new source, which is which is a display capture. So to do that, go down to, um, I'll bring up. All right, so I've got the, the OBS here, same, at, same with Streamlabs OBS as well. So go down to the little plus here and then add a display capture and make sure it's the screen, that you, the monitor that you want to capture. And then make sure the source is all the way down the bottom of your list. So you can just grab it and drag it. But you want that down the bottom of your list. So then everything else, you know, is above and it'll show up. So as you can see here, we've still got the, we've still got like the recent followers and everything else, my face and the rest of the overlays are above um, the gameplay. So you're just sitting here playing your game on your phone and everything else is the same as what it would be in a normal stream that you're using OBS or Streamlabs OBS for. So this is really good, um, not just for Twitch, obviously Mixer, Facebook, YouTube, streaming as well. Um, anything that you can connect to with Streamlabs OBS or OBS is perfect uh, for this. So it just makes it a lot easier. You can play the mobile games on stream. Some of them are super popular. Another benefit is a lot of them aren't oversaturated because a lot of people don't know how to do this. So you're going to find growth with people who are looking at mobile games on Twitch and there's only a handful of streamers who are doing it. Uh, but obviously some games, there's a lot more than a few doing it. But yeah, there is a chance there for you to grow from mobile games. All right, guys. Well, that is how you stream your phone to OBS and Streamlabs OBS and keeping your overlays and um, your webcam and everything like that, just making it look, you know, as similar to your stream as possible while still being able to play a mobile game. So if you guys like this video, please give it a thumbs up and please comment below any questions, 
any th anything regarding this. Um, you know, obviously with an Android phone would be slightly different, but I believe we'd be able to do it. I don't have an Android phone, so I can't do a video on it. I might be able to get my wife's one later um, and do one. Um, also, please feel free to subscribe to this channel if you want more content like this or more tutorials on Streamlabs, OBS, OBS, Twitch, you know, stream, any streaming platform really. Uh, just let me know. And yeah, guys, have a great day.